Foremost, I would like to give all praise, glory, and honor unto Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Harakakwadash. I would also like to give a double honors unto my apostles and elders of Great Millstone that have taught me this truth and do rule well. And I would also like to say a sincere shalom unto the hopeful elect that are scattered throughout the four winds of the earth unto the true servant, true and sincere brothers that are out there prophesying and laboring in this truth and in this doctrine unto you, I say shalom. Don't be fooled. It's all a show. All right. With this whole Trump attack, Trump assassination, it's all a show. All right. Esau, this devil Esau has used these tactics over and over and over again. They just recycling the same old shit. Okay. Uh, you know, um, and don't be fooled. All right. Esau is going to continue to put more false flag events, false information out there to get you all roused up, riled up about this election. Okay. They're going to make all these, you know, you, and you got to understand their media is one of their biggest weapons they use to push forth their agenda, to push forth their witchcraft, to put fear in the minds of the people. All right. And then you don't got eyes out to see if you're not, if you're, if you don't really have spiritual eyes to see what the hell is going on, you're going to be fall right in line with whatever their agenda they're pushing, whether it's a civil war agenda. And eventually all this bullshit that they're doing leads to the MOTB, the mark of the beast. All right. Where they're going to eventually make that, that, um, that microchip, mandatory for you to exist and survive and do anything in the society okay but you got to understand you know the times that we're living in and understand that this devil is is desperate right now all right they, they're gonna they pretty much stage a, a assassination attack where you got you know and and you know after the after the event took place you know you got you can't be quick to jump to conclusions you have to you know, get the facts and see uh, um, what's being put out there because we're living in a time where, you know, you got multiple um, media out, not necessarily media outlets. You got people with cell phones. You got Twitter. You got all these social media outlets where people are able to post information and you get the, you really get the truth. All right, where you know the, the apparently the sniper saw the guy and waited till he shot him. It's a bunch of bullshit that the prophets. That even these these uh, these truth truth uh, these so called truthers out there can see, all right. Esau, you know these um, these uh, 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 these whistleblower Edomites out there, they're able to see through all the bullshit and call it out, all right. I got another. I got this picture of this this guy Trump up here, but this says Forbes took this down. It says, "Will surviving gunfire be Donald Trump's next appeal to black voters?" All right, Jake is always a target. All right, Jake ain't got nothing to do with this, but they got everything to do with this in the eyes of these devils. All right, they they're gonna use this. All right, they already put these post these posts and these memes out here with a uh, 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 Trump with the uh, Fifty Cent Mini Man and all this stupid old shit. That's just to pull you niggas in, man. That's just to distract you, Jakes, man. Israelites. All right, with all these the the wicked left hand agenda of Esau to try to you know uh, uh, persuade your minds. To try to, you know, get your mind off what the hell is really going on. But while all this is going on, Esau is, um, they're trying to bring back the, um, you know, uh, they got the, the bird flu, the, the C-19, you know, Biden just got the C-19. You got all this shit going on, but, you know, the world is worried about the election and uh, 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 Trump. And they already know who they're going to win. Whoever wins is going to, who's the one that's going to forward and push their agenda the hardest who they can use to their advantage, all right? I'm, I'm talking about they is the wicked elite, the international uh, 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 bankers, the ones that really run the world from behind the scenes, all right? Trump and all these other so-called world leaders are nothing but puppets, all right? So let me start with, um, let me start with Isaiah 47. Isaiah 47 and 12. It says, stand now, with your enchantments and with your multitude of thy sorceries, therein thou hast labored from thy youth. If so be, thou shalt be able to profit. If so, thou mayest prevail. It says, stand down with thine enchantments. These are nothing but enchantments that they put out there to play on the emotions of all the people, not just Jake, but everyone. 
Okay, especially these these uh, these uh, these these MAGA uh, uh, Trump supporters out there. All right, and this is going to this, this event like this, this uh, this assassination attempt you could call it, is going to lead to civil war. All right, because eventually, if something else happens, you know, you're going to have people with that mindset that enough is enough. And what are they going to do? They're going to take matters into their own hands. All right, they're going to be, you know, they're going to execute judgments where they feel is fit. All right, and anyone that's opposed to that, you know, is a the scriptures say it's going to be a a nation against nation, kingdom against kingdom. They're going to be race wars, and Esau is doing nothing but stirring the pot it to make that happen. All right. Let me um let me go to numbers. Numbers uh twenty-three and twenty-three. I didn't I don't want to make this that long because I don't even want to harp on this, but this is just a message to you sincere brothers and sisters out there that don't get caught up in all the bullshit. All right, this is nothing but a smoke screen, this is nothing but just folly that they're pushing out there to distract you. All right. Um Number 23 and 23, surely there is no enchantment against Jacob, neither is there any divination against Israel. According to this time, it shall be said, Jacob Jacob and of Israel would have the most high wrought. There is no enchantment against the elect. The elect won't be fooled. All right. In, in these times, the, the, hey, Esau, no, they got the two thirds. The two thirds is they 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 ready. All right. They, they, they got the two thirds. You know, whether it be um, whatever device they're going to use, UBI, all right, a free college tuition, uh, or whatever whatever they feel Jake is um, vulnerable for, they're going to use it, all right? And, and during Jacob's trouble, it may just be a, 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 a meal, okay? It may just be shelter. It may be, uh, um, you know, a refuge from the perils that are going on in the street to get Jacob, to get Jake to uh, uh, take that MOTB, all right? Um let me grab this second uh, Corinthians two and eleven. Lest Satan should get an advantage of us, for we are not ignorant of his devices. And Satan has many devices out there that they're going to use, like I said, to try to you know uh, uh, um, you know play on your emotions, play with you know have you um, you know ha have you worried about the wrong shit? What you Israelites need to worry about is building up your faith, repenting. All right, turning to the Lord. All right, being having the Lord be your refuge. All right, because it's going to come a time, you know, where where, where Esau is going to draw that line in the sand and going to say whether you you know are you are you with me or against against me. And the Lord is going to do the same thing because when that hour of temptation comes amongst the whole world, that's going to be that moment where you know you 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 know all you Jakes that are you know can't let this can't let this society can't let this system can't let this world go, you know, you, th that's what you're going to do. You're going to take that mark of the beast to uh, continue in this wicked world. And those that don't take it are the ones that um, that resist the devil, that resist, uh, you know, that were able to, you know, make it through that hour of temptation are, are the lords that, that are, the, are the lords, are the ones that, you know, uh, are the elect. Okay. Um, let me see. Oh, let me grab um, I want to get this uh, Isaiah 29 and uh, verse 15. It says, Woe unto them that seek deep to hide their counsel from the Lord, and their works are in the dark, and they say, Who seeth us, who knoweth us? All right, that's the international, the bankers, all right, that say that, that in their mind, they're thinking that no one knows it's us. That's 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 pulling all the strings behind the, um, behind the uh, scenes. All right, but the Lord sees you because the Lord sees you, you know, because the Lord's eyes are 10,000 times brighter than the sun, but the prophets of the Lord see you through his spirit. All right, the Lord has uh, opened our eyes to see the bullshit and to call it out. All right, because that's all a part of the secret counsel of the wicked. I should have actually brought this scripture out first. Isaiah 64 and uh, 2, hide me from the secret counsel of the wicked from the insurrection of the workers of iniquity. Who wet their tongues like a sword and bend their bows to shoot their arrows, even bitter words. This is nothing part this is nothing but part of the secret council of the wicked. All right. This is a stage attack, all right, where where you know it gets the most like I said, it gets the emotions of the people going. All right, and that's what they want. All right. So the next thing that could happen could, you know, 
uh, uh, could be the tipping point for these uh, 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 um, these Trump supporters, or you know, that could be the tipping point where we, the scripture already talks about civil war. All right, let me grab that. Um, uh, actually, is it in NLT? Let me see. NLT uh, Matthew. Oh, excuse me, Mark three. And twenty, yeah, twenty three. And how was Shai called them over and responded with a illustration? How can Satan cast out Satan? And he said, he asked, a kingdom divided by civil war will collapse. All right, and and this kingdom is clearly divided. All right, and it's only a matter of time before that war, that civil war, kicks off. All right, in multiple kingdoms. All right, Rome. Um, I want to say even during the Greek, even during when the Greeks were ruling, it was, uh, uh, it was almost like civil war because you had the four generals, uh, that were under, um, Alexander the Greek, the creep, and he split his four kingdoms amongst his four generals. And after Alexander died, those four generals were fighting amongst each other to try to take each other out. That's a form of civil war. All right. Esau against Esau. All right, and, and that's that's what the classic case of what you got. All right, because it was an Edomite that did this, even though we know it was staged. But the at, the Lord is bringing that division amongst them. All right, that's what you have to understand. The Lord is in, the one that's ultimately in control. It says Isaiah nineteen and uh, two, and I will make Egyptian fight against brother. I will make Egyptian fight against Egyptian, brother against brother, neighbor against neighbor, city against city, province against province. The Lord is bringing this division. All right. The Lord wants this, wants this division. All right, that's what people don't realize. I will set the Egyptian against the Egyptian, and they shall fight everyone against his brother, and everyone against his neighbor, city against city, and kingdom against kingdom. The Lord is the one that's bringing the division. So when all this shit takes place, don't be fooled and think, you know, um, it's this or it's that. No, it's the Lord that's in the midst of, uh, uh, that's making these things happen. But the Lord controls this devil Esau. All right, it's these devils behind the scene that's really, you know, that that that's pulling all the strings because they want division, they want a civil war, they want the fight, and they want chaos so they can come and restore order. All right, so they can send in troops, so they can, uh, uh, uh you know, it's, it's a part of their new world order agenda, uh, depopulation. All right, they can bomb these cities and, um, you know, bring this chaos so they can bring that order. All right, so they can, uh, uh, uh um, you know. In their mind, usher in order, which comes in the, which comes in the form of their new world order, which is you know when they're going to implement and make mandatory that that mark of the beast, that chip. All right. So um, let me see if I had anything else. Oh, let me grab this. Ephesians uh, six and uh, ten. Finally, brethren, be strong in the Lord and in the power of His might. Put on the whole armor of the Most High that we are able to stand against the wiles of the devil. When you go to this world, wiles, I think the word is methodia. Yeah, methodia, which means their um, their trickery. Let me see. Uh, cunning art, deceit, crafty, trickery. That's what, and that's what this is. All right, this is nothing but part of their 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 um their wicked methods. All right, their 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 crafty deceit to um you know. This is nothing but like, you know how these devils, you know how in Hollywood they put together these, these um, you know, these movies, these blockbuster movies. This is nothing what it is, all right? And, and to make it even more believable, everyone's not in on it. So you, you may see some real emotions from the people, all right? But the ones that are in the know, they just acting, all right? These are nothing but actors. Trump is an actor, okay? So you can't be fooled. Don't be fooled by all this bullshit, all right? It's all a show. It's all bullshit. All right. Everything that you see in this world is 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 nothing is real. All right. Nothing is real but this truth. Okay. So, um, Lord willing, this lesson was edifying unto the elect, and I want to give all praise, glory, and honor unto Yahweh Bashimi, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim, Harakakwadash, Shalom.